Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Capricorn. This is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the week of March 22nd through the 28th. Now, I've already done one reading, but I have decided to keep it to myself. We're going to do this again. I do see that you are going to be dealing with some opposition this week. Um, but the, we had the chariot, and the chariot was opposition. Um, uh, things may not go as planned. Uh, there could be uh, an argument, okay, or you know, uh, the, obviously there's going to be some opposition. There's going to be you're going to be facing some sort of challenge this week. But we're going to start over with these cards and see what happens. So what do we have for Capricorn? What do we have for Capricorn for the week ahead? All right, we'll take those. Quill, get back to the basics. October, October is very prominent for you. Something could have happened to last October. Something could be happening this October. You could be dealing with somebody that is born in the month of October. October is prominent or fall. Dog, protection from a powerful friend. Key, successful outcome to your problems. So you will have a successful outcome. We did have gift. One of the cards that we had was you will receive a gift. So you may be receiving a gift this week. Um, there is protection from a powerful friend. October is prominent. And you, it's time for you to get back to the basics, okay? You need to get back to the basics. Just work on yourself. What do we have for Capricorn? Page of Pentacles. So that's a new door. That's a new path. A new enterprise, a new prospect, a new job, something new coming in that could lead you to stability. Okay, this is a new opportunity to start from scratch. It's not going to be easy. You may have to learn some new skills. This is setting goals, laying a new foundation, investing, investing in something new. It's not going to be easy though. Okay, you may have to, you know, as he's reading a book, you may have to learn some things. You may have to read up on this. You may have to learn some new skills, which requires you to read up on something. Yeah, I think you are going to have to learn something new. Knight of Cups. Now, the Knight of Cups is an offer of love, looking for love, looking for a relationship, emotional support. There could you could be given a proposal. Somebody could be making a heartfelt proposal to you or a heartfelt offer. Ten of Cups. Now the Ten of Cups is happiness, right? It's emotional fulfillment. It's a spiritual blessing. So you do have something coming in that is really it's real. It's genuine. It's not going to be easy. For some of you, you may be getting an offer of love from somebody that, uh, you know, you could have a long-term relationship with. If you are already in a relationship, you know, you may be, it could be news of a child. There could be news of a pregnancy because the pages represent children. Somebody could also be getting an apology. I do see flirting. I see developing a relationship. Uh happiness there is happiness here with that ten of cups there is definitely happiness happy home happy family but I, I, I see love you may be falling in love with somebody starting from scratch though the sun extreme happiness this is a beautiful new beginning this is a breakthrough it's a new day it's a life-giving energy this is a renewal it's a rebirth it is a rebirth there there definitely could be a child here there could be the birth of a child a conception of a child or news of a child whatever this is this is good news this is a happy family it's a happy home it's very comfortable it's beautiful This is good news. It is good news. If it's not a child, it's the birth of a new life. 
could be a new suitor. This is love. The heart, the sun represents love. It represents the heart. This is heart. This is heart. This is heart. Okay, so this is some sort of heartfelt gesture. Somebody is making, doing it from the heart doing the right thing. The page of pentacles and I and I should have just mentioned it is where somebody finds the focus to do the right thing even though it's not easy. So somebody may be doing the right thing, acting with integrity. They may be using their heart to do the right thing even though it's not easy. Okay? This is where somebody begins to do the right thing. For everybody involved, maybe it's for the children, maybe it's for the child. So the Knight of Cups is a proposal, it's an offer, it's acting with the, from the heart. So you may, be, you may be reacting from your heart or you're receiving an, an offer from somebody that is being very real, being very genuine. You know, this is definitely a real opportunity for happiness, a lot of happiness, extreme happiness. Healing, you know, it's a healing love. Ten of Cups is in your future. That's permanent love. That's the storm is over. It's happiness. It's fulfillment. It's abundance. Abundance with the family, with the home, with a partner. Two of Pentacles reversed. And Ten of Swords reversed. Now the Ten of this has like been a painful situation. Somebody has been in a painful situation, but I think it's over. This is freedom. It's liberation. There's been some sort of imbalance. Maybe there's been a mental imbalance because this is typically mental swords, but it can be physical as well. The two of pentacles reverse is a poor decision. Somebody has made a poor decision. This is giving up. Somebody has been juggling. They've been trying to do too much. This is letting something go for happiness, letting something go so that everybody can be happy. There is happiness here. This is making a choice to be happy. You may be making a choice to be happy and that may mean letting go of something that hurt you, that was really, really painful to you. <laughs> the Ten of Swords is like a near-death experience. Something that, I don't know, there's, there could be, this is a, I don't know if there's a fall, you know, or something like that. This is somebody that's trying to do too much. There's an imbalance here. This is a, mis a, a misalignment. Somebody has been trying to do something. Now they're, now they're, they've reached the end. It's like, it's, I don't know, this is letting something go. Somebody is letting something go. Letting go of pain. This is seeing the light, becoming enlightened, dropping something, dropping, dropping something. I feel like you're going to be letting something go, and, and it's and it's because of your your well, you want to heal. You just want happiness. It's like I just want to be happy, and I feel because you get to that mindset, everything falls into place. You don't have to play any more games. You don't have to juggle. Things start to get better. The sun comes out. You know, this is a spiritual blessing of some sort. And remember I said in the, before we got gift. This is a gift. Receiving a gift. Somebody is going to be receiving a gift from somebody that, you know, sees their value. Because that page of pentacles is about value. Whoever this person is that is giving the gift is doing it out of integrity, you know, and this person does have integrity. This person is real. This person is willing to put in the effort. They're willing to do whatever it takes, and they know it's not going to be easy. Somebody's going to be receiving an offer. 
Okay, they are going to be receiving a heartfelt, genuine, real offer from somebody. And it's going to make them extremely happy. And it's going to end the, the suffering, whatever the suffering was. I feel like this is the end of it. It's the end of the pain. It's the end of the suffering. Somebody has been biting off more than they can chew with this card. They've made some poor decisions. They didn't have any, uh, well, the Two of Pentacles reverse. It's like no contingency plan. I think we have the end of a relationship and the beginning of something new. Somebody was dealing with an individual that probably hurt them very, very badly and they were playing games with that person. I think it's the end of playing games, put it that way. Juggling is a game. Somebody's been playing games and they've been hurtful, painful games. Maybe it's with a Leo. Could be. <laughs> Leo could be a, a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Could be a, a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. It's all done playing games. It's dropping it. I'm dropping it. I'm done. I'm done playing games. I'm done going back and forth. Somebody has made a poor decision to even play with this person. But I feel like there's enlightenment here. This is like seeing the light. This is becoming aware. It's highly aware. You know, and, re and, and maybe accepting another offer or seeing things differently, willing to put in effort to do whatever it takes to bring happiness. There is a happy new beginning here, okay? With that sun card. That is a yes answer. It's, it's, it's a warm place. It's healing. It's being accepted. It's a new day. It's a new beginning. It's a breakthrough, right? It's, it's a blessing. Somebody is being blessed. They're being blessed with a new life, a new beginning. Eight of Pentacles. Now, the Eight of Pentacles is working together. It's working out. It's working hard, putting in effort. So I do believe that there is somebody here that is going to be putting in effort. They are going to, they're going to put in, they're going to work. They're going to work at being happy. They're going to work at uh, starting over. Somebody's going to be putting in effort putting in effort into a relationship, into a new beginning. This is beautiful. It is. It's a bright opportunity for happiness. So we have a new day here. There's something new. This is the this is the birth of something new. wish granted this is your prayers being this is a blessing somebody is about to be blessed it's like their prayers have been heard prayers are being answered this is a wish being granted this is a renewal it is some sort of renewal this is a healing energy this is a guiding light we have guiding light twice there's some sort of protection here protection from a powerful friend. I feel like there's some somebody is being protected. Somebody is being there's a reason. This is a re, there's a reason why everything happens. There is something better. There's something beautiful that is coming in. Everything is going to work out as it should. Somebody is going to be receiving an offer that leads them towards long-term stability. This is what they asked for. Page of Pentacles is about manifestation, and this is something that you asked for. Somebody is going to be receiving an offer that's going to make them extremely happy. This is a healing energy, a very healing. It's like a healing love. It's a healing light. It's, and it's, it's, it's seeing the light. Somebody may become enlightened. They just see the light. They see the light and they want to work together with somebody after they didn't see the light in the past. 
somebody was in a deep dark place they were and they were suffering but this is definitely the end of suffering the seven of wands is in a tough position okay we have somebody here that has been in a tough position and I feel like it's time to relax you can relax now Somebody is going to be receiving a beautiful offer, okay? This is absolutely beautiful. I mean, what more can I say? Could be from a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Could be from an Aquarius. Could be from a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Whoever this person is, this person is doing it from their heart. They, are, they, are, they want to... Uh, They want a happy relationship. They want, they want, they may want forever, you know, with that Ten of Cups. This person, um, I feel like they're, they're real. They're real. Now, this could even be a job offer if it's not a relationship offer. It could be with that Page of Pentacles. This is a new enterprise, right? laying a new foundation with somebody and it's starting from scratch whatever this is this is this this leads it feels like leads to happily ever after but it's not going to be easy it's not it comes after a painful situation because of this ten of swords it comes after suffering there has been a lot of suffering but this is freedom. It is freedom from suffering. This comes after the tower. Obviously, there's been a tower moment. There's been an event. This is where help arrives. So help is help is arriving. It's going to be a lot of work. I do see that it's going to be a lot of work to heal from something. And maybe there's been a betrayal. But I do think that there is somebody here to help you heal. They're going to help you heal from, this is a betrayal. There has been a betrayal. You are going to heal. Somebody is here. This is a healing love. It absolutely is. So there could be an offer or an invite that is coming after there has been a tower moment, after there's been major, you know, a major disruption or a major life change or something like that. There's been some sort of major disruption. This is your help. This is your fairy godmother that is here to bless you with a gift for all that you have been through. I feel like you are going to be socializing with somebody new and somebody is going to be putting in effort to uh, help you heal from whatever this is that you've been through. Good luck.